Hi everybody, this is C3 Readings and this reading is going to be for Leo, Leo Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Let's see what are the messages that will pop out for you, Leo. Check out the link in the description box, it's going to take you to the extended and in the extended we will clarify more for your person. How are they thinking and feeling about you, their next moves towards you, um, outcome of the situation, advice, oracle messages, love notes. Um, as well as love messages towards the end and general um, energy updates for your life. So do check it out. It is going to be linked below for further details. Let's see what have we got for Leo. What have we got for Leo? We have the death card. Hmm. With the four of cups and the seven of cups. All right, so to me, this kind of looks like something came to an end here, but didn't really came to an end. Um, so it's that energy of... I think you, you felt emotionally neglected in a situation, and that kind of put you off. You know, when something just like, mm, I wanted this but this happened so uh, I don't want this anymore kind of an energy that I'm getting from you with the death energy being here this is like putting an end to something but with the four of cups and the seven of cups there's still some thinking about it um, possibly because you are still emotionally invested um, but for the most part I think if it happens one more time you're gonna be done but but I do see you being very done already um with the four of cups maybe you felt neglected maybe you felt like the person was not being emotionally available for you for whatever reason you know and with that um seven of cups energy i actually see some indecision here um in love or having to choose between things between people between i don't know okay let's see we have the five of swords again you know in a certain situation you do feel i apologize that's my bluetooth okay uh with the five of swords energy being here it does look like you you it there was manipulation there was mind games involved in a certain situation which is why i think you might be you might be getting bored of it now because it has happened several times, Leo, that you're kind of like, you know, I know, I know what's happening. Kind of an energy um, with the Seven of Swords. Yeah, somebody was being sneaky. Somebody was uh, not being honest with you. But again, this is that energy of looking back, but still walking away, which is your energy. Okay, so I do feel like you're focused on things in your life. Uh, where you might be, you know, focusing on your stability, focusing on what matters and things like that. But there's that feeling of um, still looking back, but not being like the one who initiates it kind of an energy for whatever reason. Okay. You may even feel like if I you know indulge in this there is going to be the same outcome so again this is like you getting tired okay this is like you getting bored okay with the hermit i do see you closing off to this energy i see you contemplating you know i see you contemplating and healing with the page of swords the Six of Swords. There are so many swords here. It could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Virgo, Scorpio that you're connecting with. We have Leo, Aries, Sag too. So I see you coming out of a situation with a lot of curiosity, uh, Leo. There's a lot of that energy of, yes, I am so ready to take that new path. Okay, I'm so ready for this new thing. Uh, but right now it's more so looking like it's in your head and you're mentally withdrawing from something. Uh, and distracting yourself and being like, yes, I'm so open to something new, you know, to explore and things like that. I see you being very open to that energy, very energetic and very open to receive uh, and to open to 
walk a new path here okay whatever that might be for you um but there's that energy of you walking away but why am i getting that you're still walking away looking back leo probably because of your um attachment uh to the situation or a certain outcome here still you're still a little bit hopeful but again that you're not going to be initiating you have made up your mind to leave but you're still looking back in case if it works out uh with the knight of wands energy and the six of swords it almost looks like you don't trust this person whoever you're dealing with maybe they were playing mind games with you maybe they were showing up for you and then disappearing because there's a lot of that energy of somebody um talking about giving you the world but disappearing on you over and over again which is why you feel emotionally neglected and which is why you want to just like do your own thing now okay i still see that energy pop up here okay the, of the same person but we will see with that three of swords two of wands and the page of pentacles so I think whatever situation broke your heart, you, you are planning to leave it behind um, and walk some sort of a new path here. Some of you might be starting new in, you know, in your business, um, might, you know, you might be wanting to, you know, start a new project. I see you kind of like being in that energy of I've gotten my heart broken. There could still be that underlying pain coming from the situation of you know because it's really painful when somebody breadcrumbs you um so again this is you recognizing that and trying to walk away from it as much as possible and manifesting something new into your life okay the overall energy for you we have the five of wands the ace of cups the lovers so i do feel like in the past you were very hopeful oh i got something leo it's it's almost like this the, the situation would seem like there's potential of growth you know yes it's getting there i'm so excited but then it would drop and then it would pick up some pace you would feel passionate then it would drop again so for whatever reason there was constant um push and pull in the energy and resistance in the energy which is kind of like hindering this and i just see even if there was love because i do feel like there was love but there is distance as well okay let's see tell me more about this situation for leo what more do we have for leo check out the link in the description box leo it's going to take you to the extended and in the extended we will clarify more for your person we have the lovers, the fool, and the ten of wands. Let's see. Tell me more about this fool and the lovers. You know what I'm getting with this, Leo? there's some sort of a weight that you're dropping okay you do not want to be carrying that unnecessary weight and burdening your own energy so i feel like you just want to give up on something because it feels nice to not have to worry about a situation what is this lover's energy with the page of cups we have a lot of pages here i do see some sort of a love offer coming in for you like very flirtatious and it is seeming very new very fresh in the energy um i see you letting go of the past as well so this could be a past person as well who comes your way this could be a new energy for the most part this is seeming new we have the sun the ace of swords and the six of pentacles at the bottom of the deck this is new this is that sudden burst of um an energy very motivating energy where you're headed towards your happiness doing everything to make yourself happy putting yourself first and you know feeling free there's that sense of freedom here that i'm also getting from this reading you letting go of a certain situation to free yourself from something and ultimately i do feel like you're going to be in a situation where there will be equal give and take let's get you one more card let's see
with the seven of pentacles and the ten of pentacles i do see a relationship coming your way but it's gonna start off slow again you know but it is it has the potential of something great it has the potential of growth here again and um yeah I, for some of you i see money coming in as well okay it's good energy so let's see Check out the link in the description box for the extended. I'm going to be talking more about your person. How are they thinking, feeling about you? Who's coming in love towards you? What is the outcome of the situation between the two of you? Advice, oracle messages, love notes, as well as love messages. So do check it out. And general advice for you. So we have a lot in there in that reading. Do check it out. Okay. Let's see. What have you got for Leo? What have we got for Leo? Dance with life. Do something to change your energy. Mm. Change your energy if you're feeling stuck in an energy. If you feel stuck in a situation, your guidance is divinely guided. Again, you are being guided towards the right path. You just have to trust it. Let's get you one more. It's all coming together. Intuitive hit soul tribe. Ooh, so things are unfolding in your life just the way they should be, okay? Let's see. What messages do we have for Leo? I did see the very soon card. Let's see. What have we got for Leo? Okay. Codependency addictions are affecting your romantic life. Something might still be holding you back. Um, could be codependency on your part or your person's part. You deserve love. You are lovable. This is that energy of, I deserve better, and, you know, I'm going to go after it. We have reconciliation, and this could be the one as well. So, again, this could be a new beginning with a past person or a brand new person, but this is looking like a new beginning in love, regardless of whoever this is. There's reconciliation. It fell on the floor for you. Somebody from your past is returning, and this could be the one. What is that? This could be the one energy. What is that about? Let's see. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Okay. There is somebody wanting another chance with you. They want to work on things with you. But it almost looks like you're trying to drop this. Okay. Again, it's all up to you, right? So that's about it. Those were the energies that popped out for Leo. Give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. Check out the link in the description box. It's going to take you to the extended for further clarifications. I am going to clarify this past person and, you know, this new beginning in love. And like I said, further love messages and guidance for you. Do check it out. It's going to be linked below. Take care and bye-bye.